Hello, this is Wilhole100 coming back to you with the fifth part in the series of trying to figure out how to play this game again. So I'm watching my culture, or watching myself get culture ward, from which source I don't actually know offhand. Maybe one of their capital ships is spreading out? Possibly. Yeah, that makes sense. Capital ship might be spreading culture. Your capital is there. We'll just go straight for your capital. Well, the experimental weapon is either firing or going or being constructed. Blowing another one of their ships up. Another capital ship going down. Yeah, it looks like two without that upgrade per per star. Oh, you've already been poked by someone. Guess my ally must have been been here a little while ago. Well, if we can blow up that planet, it'll take one of the one of the enemies out of the war, including the one that has the, the Titan ship, which technically doesn't actually remove the Titan ship. It'll still sit there and shoot anything that comes in the gravity well, but. Yeah, pirates. I think I'm gonna let you have that planet. You, you you can have that planet for now. I don't think it's worth fighting you over. Got uh, more important things to deal with. You on auto grab. This one, I'm not so worried about a planet. Uh, same over here, I'll grab, grab this one and put you on auto grab. So if there's an available planet, you're in the gravity wall, grab it. Just to be annoying to our enemies. It's only about a third of the planet left to go in bombardment. It's already about half down when we got here, so that's a good start. If we knock them out, then we can come over to the blue one and possibly do the same thing. And have this nice short game where I run around with a chicken with his head cut off. Only surviving because the strategy wasn't half bad to start with. And then only 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 functioned half well because the AI is a little slow at going from system to system. Do a later somewhat fixed um, tech path. Experimental weapon going off again. These computers in there, they're experimental weapons. And, and their incessant use of three purge vessels going in poking planets. It's also really annoying. Nope, oh, just just uh, knocked a knocked a enemy off the planet off the game. It's 
So they're technically dead, so they'll stop building stuff and running around, but they'll still have their shifts whatever they left them. Yeah, they kind of hate my butts. Too many packs yet? No, because I haven't, I haven't improved my relationship with them. It's only been one or Our diplomatic relations here have been one way. Grab a few of these and send them to planets. Oh, I might not be able to colonize because of uh, influence. I'm wondering why I'm not spontaneously taking the planet. It's probably not even worth sitting here if I can't take the planet. Yeah, let's just, let's just go to the other one and see how that works. Nova Lith weapon, yeah. So they're they're, they're actually maybe maybe the uh, planet was hard or significantly damaged, not because the yellow had shown up, but because they'd uh, Nova Lift cannoned it multiple times. Send one there, and the other one there. Get, get some diplomatic stuff going on. Couple ship shields, where? Talking about these ones? No, you're talking talking about the other fleet, which is probably the more important fleet for me to be worried about. No, no, it must have been that fleet. This fleet's full health. And if it's that fleet, then I'm not worried about it because those pirates aren't going to be strong enough to take any of them out. Actually, is this the, this this should be their capital then? Slightly, slightly, slightly. Blah. Slightly different orientation with their home system then. Or else I started with the desert one and then I'd be weird. Oh wait. I'm being really stupid. This blue planet. Not this blue Terran planet, because this blue Terran planet is the one I just blew up. Obviously they're not in the big blue Terran planet I just blew up. You know, let's, let's get some culture going so that if they're in any of our systems, we can slowly push the culture back. Do, do, do. At least the pirates left. We've taken that planet. Let's. Insufficient metal. Move that there. This guy, move you over to here. Get there in time, that'll be more money for us. Let's go ahead and get ourselves. Oh, I don't have enough metal. I have a metal shortage for some reason. Probably because all my metal mines have been destroyed. And I haven't gone around to replace them yet. Or maybe because most of my worlds are ice planets that have. Gem mines, which is why I have a lot of gems. That appears to be the case. Uh, diplomacy, so those, oh, those two are done. So maybe we have enough now that I can propose packs. I still need higher relations, because I am a nub. I am a nub. I 
I think I found the enemy fleet. How many cavalry ships are here? Two. One of them's half dead. Yeah, we, we can deal with this. We, we can win this battle. As long as this guy doesn't go running off. Probably going to lose our, our new... Uh, the new coal class battleship is going to blow up again. That's okay. Ooh, they went ahead and actually built a uh, star base in their capital in their home system. Let me get, oh, the Pirate Raiders are actually after my alley this time, because the pink are dead, and the blue don't have any bounty yet. Why can't I raise bounty on them? Why is my bounty button not working? I don't know. Oh, because they're rebels, so I can't raise bounty on them, and the other guy is dead, so the bounty can't be raised on them. Ah, it all makes sense now. Okay, well, blow up the planet and end this game. So I've been running around with the... Like I'm chicken with his head cut off. I've been doing fairly okay this game. My, my somewhat... pre-thought-out strategy of dealing with, um... My enemy has worked okay. I lost a capital ship. Let me guess, that's uh, this one over here? Yep, I can still see it blowing up. Okay, so we traded a capital ship for a capital ship, and I think theirs was a higher level, so that'll be fine. Experimental weapon fire. Probably ours. Probably my allies firing their experimental weapon again. I'm going to start rearranging my capital ships so they can go together to quickly destroy planets. So let's go with a siege capital ship. Well, there goes the fleet off to kill Yellow. Right past one of Yellow's guys, but okay. So we get rid of the enemy capital ship. Okay, now you can turn on colonies again, because if you go and colonize the planet, they won't just spontaneously blow it up again. And how are we going on over here? Planet's half gone. Good start. Oddly enough, the best way to take out a star base is to get lots of strike craft bombers and just sit back from a distance where it can't kill you and bomb it to hell. Because bombers do extra damage versus structures and capital ships. Whereas it usually lacks weapons to actually fire at strike craft, so fairly effective way to, to knock it out. Yeah, so this should should be a nice short game. I think, I think we're gonna finish it up here on I think this is part five. F only for the reason why I put on the uh, capital planets takeout. Normally, I've done, I think in the past I was doing free for all games, so at least the AI would fight each other. This one, I've only got one AI on my side, which is fighting them, but worked out okay. Yeah, so I doubt they can take out my capital ships as they pound this one planet into non existence.
it gets there in time, it can help finish that planet off. Superior gunnery, furious defense. Why are some of my clicks not working? The game, oh, the, yeah, the game's lagging a bit. I'm down to about, because uh, well, I was too zoomed in on weapons fire is what was occurring. My frame rate had uh, dropped a tad bit. Uh, yeah, uh, this this is, looks like it's going to be the last part as soon as I blow this planet up. Which means it's kind of pointless to end the episode in four minutes because the episode or the entire series is probably going to end in about five. So I'm going to turn off the timer so it doesn't doesn't make any noise. I'm going to just finish bombing this planet into non-existence. How goes the rest of the system? So our ally is colonizing over here, which is good. So it looks like the Loyalists are going to win. See, a little bit of chaos, because it's hard to predict where they're going to come from. Because they can go from any star to any star, but other than that, it's a fairly, fairly simple game, because you can just dish, dash in and blow up a main capital star, or capital planet like this. And there goes the end. Well, I'm uh, Wilkul100. If you've liked this series and want to see something else, please leave me a comment. If you've liked this series and want me to do something else, uh, once again, leave me a comment, tell me what, I, what you want me to do. If you want to see something different, leave me a comment, tell me what you want me to do. And if you want to see any of the other stuff that I record later, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. That's the best way to be notified when new stuff comes out. Until next time, this is Wilkul100.